the protests in Hong Kong right now, it's almost like Hong Kong is bragging. <laughs> They're like, we're doing, we dealt with the virus so well, we're outside complaining about other things. <laughs> I, lo I love it because I was living in Shanghai for, for 10 years and my parents would always call me up. They'd be like, do you have any rights over there? Do you have any human rights? Are you safe? And now they're all like trapped in isolation in Australia. I'm like, hey, mom and dad, are you allowed outside yet? <laughs> in your dictatorship? Is it, is it still illegal to get a haircut in your shithole country? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I couldn't hear you. I was hiking to a beach again. <laughs> living in paradise right now. It's amazing. I was, uh, I was in Australia, actually, I'm going to say more than two weeks ago. Um, no wristband. No wristband. We're good. We're good. Uh, now, I was here in January, and like January was like just when the virus was starting to get popular. And uh, so I didn't really know what it was. Someone comes up to me, he's like, oh, do you have that fever that people get when they go to Asia? I was like, Yellow fever? <laughs> because, yes, I do, yeah. I've been in quarantine for 10 years now. It's horrible. I isolated myself from my family. It's great. So many crazy things, though. Like, you guys heard that, that they said that coronavirus started in bat soup. But did you know that China responded to that accusation? It's true. They said that, that bat soup is not a delicacy in Wuhan. In Wuhan, they only eat fried bat. I was like, China, I think you misunderstood the problem with the bat soup. <laughs> you had a 50-50 chance of guessing which word was the problem with bat soup. <laughs> and you were very close. <laughs> and yet so far away. You know? I kind of want to go to a restaurant where like the soup of the day is bat soup. And just watch people like, what's the soup of the day? Bat soup. Oh, I, I think I think I'm gonna have the salad. I'm like, all right, table seven, one bat salad coming up. <laughs> that is a stupid joke. Even I can admit that. A lot of crazy things though. There's people. There's a big controversy about calling it the Chinese virus, and some people say, "Well, we say Spanish flu. Why can't we say Chinese virus?" But that is not the same thing. Same Chinese virus. It's not the same as saying Spanish flu because everybody loves Spain. <laughs> Nobody's like, yeah, of course it happened in Spain, yeah. Because they eat all that bat paella. No. <laughs> also, Spain wasn't like, it started in Poland. <laughs> some people were like, if you're, you know, some of my friends are like, oh, if you don't, really, if you don't believe China's numbers, you're racist. It's like, just because. I'm racist doesn't mean the numbers are real. You know? <laughs> it's not how statistics work at all. <laughs> and also, like, it's like, people are like, why don't you believe the numbers? It's like, well, you know, like, remember how China said that Taiwan's not a country? And it's clearly a country. That's not great for credibility. Right? <laughs> like, if I came up to you and I was like, hey, it's going to rain tomorrow, also, Benedict Cumberpatch is not a person. You'd be like, I don't know about that weather report. <laughs> I need to get a second opinion on this. <laughs> There's another one that, you know, they tried to say, China had like a moment. Was, I feel like China just tries stuff out, you know? They're like, maybe this happened. We're like, that's ridiculous. Okay, uh, what about this other thing? <laughs> They're just fishing until we're like, yeah, yeah, maybe that did happen. They're like, yeah, that's what we've been saying all along. <laughs> Quick, change all our websites, change them all. It's, it's, it's fucking ridiculous. Like, well, there was a moment where they were like, oh, the US Army started it. It's like, oh, yeah, sure, yeah. They attacked the strategic outpost of a wet market in Wuhan. Yeah. <laughs> How did they leave that Achilles heel unprotected? <laughs> really, it was foolish to leave it just hanging out there like that. It's so fucking stupid. But I have this idea, right? I don't know. Like, I'm not a numbers guy, clearly. But, like, I just think that, statistically, the first person to get COVID must have survived. Right? They're probably just sitting at home right now, watching the news. <laughs> just like, whew, that, that, that got out of hand. <laughs> I am 
a Batman. <laughs> Dad said I'd never amount to anything, but I certainly <laughs> changed the world this week. That's, but that is definitely the last time I fuck a bat. Yeah. I'm not doing that again. You know. Boy, was that embarrassing. They come into my hotel room, they're like, why is the bat wet? It was soup. It was soup. It was soup. It definitely was not fucking it repeatedly. That's not what was happening at all.